the Tesla Dome. It's electric. I also have no idea how good this thing is going to be because it is completely new. So it's not like it has, at least as far as I know, nearly as much work on it as the other couple domes. Also gonna switch up the gadget to orchard, I suppose? Grows fruits to buff movement and mining power, which seems good, but not as obvious of usage as the other gadgets that exist there. And I'm just gonna stick with the with the engineer because, well, I tried the assessor. You saw how that went. <laughs> Let's keep with some that I know how to use, right? Also, I don't really know if this is necessarily a dome. It's a big, uh, a big triangle. Really, usually you think of that as being round, but maybe mathematically that is still considered to be a dome. Move it around. Can I use the mouse? I actually turned on the mouse cursor for this one, so I can see if this will work or not. Does seem like it's going to be good against a lot of melee attackers, but... Okay. Use the many abilities. They're really telling me, hey, make sure that you, you upgrade this one. You're going to want to do that, and you get a dome. A, small do a smaller dome inside of the dome to be able to use this dome. Moves faster, quick shot. Yeah, probably want that one. Moving fast seems also pretty good. If this is gonna actually be like using, say, mouse controls with Binding of Isaac. Do want to make sure. Hmm. Do want to make sure that I end up getting that because that's always the most annoying part of that whole thing there. Okay. Nope, I just clicked off screen. It is definitely not letting me do this. Now, this is interesting to see that it is not really too zoomed out now, is it? Also, it does appear as though the the actual uh, engineer themselves is the like reticle that I'm shooting around there, which is kind of funny. Okay, well... Let's see how this one goes. I do want to try and get a successful run because, of course, that is how I'm going to be able to get the next the next dome as well. And if I'm not able to do that, then it's likely going to be... Oh, also, I'm noticing, is the health bar different or something? Because it definitely seems to be a di di different type of... Oh, no, that's the fruit meter. I see. Okay, that makes sense. Yeah, I've never used Orchard. I have never even seen Orchard be used. I don't know what this thing is at all. It does say that, you know, hey, you get a lot of buffs. Buffs are cool, but are they going to be the sort of thing that I want? Do I really want all these eggplants? Because that appears to be what I'm getting here? I don't know. Surprised to see that apparently still not getting attacked just yet. No? Okay, there it is. I should have seen that coming. I, I had a feeling that it was about right there, so anyway. All right, how does this work now? You know that, and does it automatically shoot? No, it looks like I still need to click on it regardless. Yeah. That took a few shots. I don't know. Okay, give me that here. Yeah, health capacity, but... Hmm. Well, I guess give it to me, right? Well, I thought that normally showed before I got that. This place that don't... Did I... Do I... Did I never notice that... Do I always get this so quickly that I never noticed that I wasn't able to see the capacity of the dome... Before that. That might actually be the case. Well, as it is, uh, I could wait for an eggplant there, but I'm sure I'm probably going to get uh, something before that, right? For example, this iron right here. Which I did see coming, of course. Yeah, make sure I don't throw that directly down the shaft there, right? Now, I should also see what the upgrades are for the for the orchard just to see what I'm actually looking at right now. 
So, before I do that, what do you got? Yeah, buff duration, of course. Overcharge to make it grow faster, as you expect. Okay, so it does actually do some stuff for the dome itself. Doesn't just uh, grow things. Trying to give buffs here. Get pack speed boost, mining boost, which all seems decent. I'll grab that before taking it, right? Uh, let's take the mining boost here. It's sort of minimal enough. I can also go take this right now. And there. I'll, and then I'll grab this, I think, immediately. So that should be... No, stop. Uh, there we go. Alright. Get it going. So I, got, I should have big mine... I don't know if it is retroactive, like if it will be working right now. For the thing that I just grew, or what. But I am hoping that this will do that. Make this nice and easy. Because I really don't know exactly how many hits it usually... Oh, wait. How many hits it usually takes to destroy uh, various rocks at this point in the game. Now then. Is there even anything that I can afford? No. Of course not. All right. Oh, you do need to have it fully charged up before that works, eh? So yeah, it seems like unupgraded. This isn't really going to be a super amazing type of weapon. No, maybe as it gets upgraded. I mean, I'm hoping that it's going to turn into something really amazing. Okay, I already get getting these down in one hit. Sort of expect that though. Water and maybe getting the supercharge is actually going to be the most worthwhile thing immediately. Okay, actually, let's try and grab the iron first, right? Drop one of them because, you know. Okay, whatever. It doesn't seem like the game's going to let me do that. And four is just too many to get, right? Of course. Uh, well, maybe movement speed. Obviously, if I'm going to be getting the orchard, it seems like attempting to go and grab the... the uh, carrying capacity is going to be the most worthwhile upgrade to get first, right? Because that one is the only thing that I do not think I can get just by uh, getting good, good it really does just look like an eggplant getting good eggplants alone alright, alright, should be able to get that up there fast enough, takes so long to kill everything that I should probably be getting up here faster just alone, but you know what I'm saying I'm, I'm just doing this like, I need it. Okay, so it zooms out. Oh, it zooms out slowly. I don't think I can hit that then. Uh, I can hit this here. And I have absolutely no... And of course I have absolutely no... Uh, ability to stop this right now. I don't know if Orchard is quite the... Oh, wait, give me that. Orchard is quite the best uh, the best synergy here right now with this particular dome. Seems likely that I would want something a little bit more defensive, right? Tiny area to start with. Okay. Maybe this will be the thing that will save me because <laughs> it's not looking too hot right now, I'll say that. I guess I'm going to have to make sure that I get to the, get to the, the command chair there faster than... Normal. Stun laser, auto cannon. Eh, stun could be good. Shred to cobalt is probably what I should take it just to be able to survive here. But I'm gonna take the auto cannon. I like that thing. It's a good it's a good sort of uh, way to get a little bit of extra damage there, especially if I'm going to need to be buffing up stuff an awful lot here, right? Okay, let's go down just a little bit more and then go back up. Because I'm sure by the time that I get back up here. And I found nothing going down that gigantic shaft. Uh, but yeah. Found nothing, but... Uh, I should uh, hopefully just clear up things for the future. What am I even saying? There's nothing. I'm getting nothing out of that. 
Eh, improved auto cannon. I'm just gonna take this. Hey, when I inevitably lose at this point, I'm just gonna take that and uh, use it for future stuff. Okay, so yeah, definitely does seem like I just want to go. Maybe prioritize upgrades on the upgrades on the, the dome here first, given uh, what we're looking at right now. Wait, uh, no. No eggplants yet. All right. Well, so... Yeah, hurry up with that, I suppose. Don't worry too much about mining. Even though it's like mining is how you get upgrades, of course. It doesn't really make too much of a difference, then, if uh, you can't uh, if you can't actually defend yourself at all from anything. Okay. Even the, uh, even the uh, sword as an immediate starting type of item was doing a lot better there. Okay. Miracle speed, eh, quick shot strength. Firing as a shooting charge on. Ah, uh, is that the one I want though, or do I just want to go like, hey, give me more damage, period? Auto wing, probably not. Electro orb. Stun strength. Hey, which one would be the best to start with? Let's just go with raw damage. How about that? And really hope that I'm about to get something else here. Yeah, come on, come on. I was hoping that I could get that a little bit faster, but eh, whatever. Look, I'm just gonna go with what I got. I'm gonna see if I can grab anything else. Okay, that's maybe the thing that's gonna save this. I'm just just buying a little bit of extra time while I need to while I get upgrades for the next round, right? That sort of thing. Cause yeesh. <laughs> Okay, I guess that is it for that then. All right, let's see what we got. It's weird that it has like dynamic zoom out type of stuff. And okay, well that at least took it out immediately. Okay, at least the auto cannon's doing a good job down there. All right, doesn't shoot if you do it half. Oh. No, well, not amazing, but yeah, it doesn't shoot if you only do it partial shots, right? And it does seem to make quite a bit of a difference to try and uh, anticipate enemy movements or not. Yeah, you really need to make sure that you are looking at where enemies are. Thing here. I had a feeling about that one, although I would have found it anyway if I just kept going. Water. Not quite what I'm looking for, really. Whatever, I'm just going to go down one of these sides, hope for the best. I feel like I'm really not finding a whole lot of resources in this map. Which is surprising me. <laughs> and the resources I do find are in the, the hardest possible areas. I just drop one, make sure that I can actually get these back up. You know what? No, no, I don't want those. I want to go. What I want to do is I want to try and just grab more iron, but I don't think that's going to happen. So get everything, right? <laughs> Good. I don't even have the buff on anymore. Oh, yeah, no, this one. I, th I think this dome is done. It's barely even started. It's been like 10 minutes. Well, is there any... Well, whatever. Just go for it. Yep. Uh... I don't have any stun timing on the... The thing. Uh... And the rank, it doesn't work if you don't have a full charge. Nope. Wow. <laughs> Maybe the uh, fastest that I've died in this game so far. I'll take it. Now start another run and do it. Uh, 
I don't know about the orchard here. Shield would be pretty nice. At least to, to begin with, right? Hmm. Yeah. Let's get right into it then, I suppose. Try one more time. I think I understand a little bit more. We really, really, really have to prioritize powering up the dome here first, as far as I can tell. And also get my hands on the correct keys to make this work. I mean, not only that, just also try and... Uh, hope for a little bit better resource placement. Didn't quite work out there immediately, but it should be better now, right? Surely it can't get worse. Surely. All right. So number one, I'll just go with... Did I not get six? I guess not. Well, that's fine. Provided that I can find even one more before we start here. Now with a little bit of shielding, knowing that I am definitely going to get hit at the very beginning here. Well, we start out right away with the brickwork, eh? All right. Well... I'll deal with it, I suppose. Should probably start getting back up there. Go one more. Eh, it's, yeah, this is being greedy, but also this is the very start of the game, so at least I have a fully powered up dome to begin with, if nothing else. Okay. There, and now I can go and get the extra power. Go and... Man, I should do this well enough. Yeah, grab that since I got the six otherwise for even more damage. And then I'll probably just go for this one next, the Electro Orb. Seems like a good idea. Yep, and I called it. It was actually even... Good. <sighs> so even if enemies don't quite die on the first salvo of hits there... That, uh, that auto cannon will largely take out the rest of it, right? It's not really the best sort of thing to have to go for yeah, the brickwork type of iron, but at the same time, it is manageable compared to the other stuff. So, I think I'll be able to manage this. <laughs> I think. I don't know. All right, three, but we are going all in on the dome upgrades to start with. I want to make sure that I have the basic coverage of able to kill enemies before I even start with anything else, right? I'm just going to start digging into some of the uh, softer dirt, as it were, to start. And we can go for more advanced dirt later on. Something I really don't consider too much, but that's because, you know... Oh. Alright, well, I did... No, 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 I don't have the autonomy thing to... Try and... Yeah, here. You know what? Give me that. I don't know if that's necessarily the best idea. This should work. Okay. And it looks like the shield took most of the damage there, too. So, I'm gonna go down farther. You know what? forget about this just until I'm able to get through this particular brickwork here. Just gotta anger the gods in Noida. Just a little bit. Not too angry or anything. Then it should be at least a little bit better for now. Ugh. I feel like the, the generation of these levels is not really working too well for me. At the same time, though, it's a nice. Hey, nice. That's what I like to say. Hey, nice. Water, which is, you know, of questionable use, but the cobalt is probably going to be nice. Maybe I'm just getting a little bit paranoid. Maybe paranoid. Uh, garbage song. Um, I don't have, I don't have the willingness to try and make the full reference. But anyway. Uh, da, 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 one. I mean, it, Yes. <laughs> Shows how many things survive. Whatever. Uh, nothing else really of much interest. Let's just go for it. Where are you coming in from? All right. Is there any possible way I'm going to get this? Because it has to be fully charged up. Okay. 
Working for these first couple runs, I suppose. Uh, first couple runs, first couple waves. <laughs> a little bit different wording there, you could say, but I would actually say no. It's the exact same wording. In the exact same way. All right, Dome Keeper. It's funny because with a specific, uh, just going into a soft and derp right now. With a specific type of build, I feel pretty confident in my ability to actually beat this game with at least some regularity. But at the same time, the point of these bonus episodes, when I even really call it that, like sort of. Okay, and there's no way I'm going to be able to carry any more than that. Of course, it has to be all water, and I can't specifically drop this and that and all that sort of thing. Uh, with these uh, the bonus episodes now that I've gotten a win on the game. Yeah, sure, let's just call it that. It's like, it is, the point is that I'm using a bunch of different new things. I've got absolutely nothing. Okay. Let's see if I can get you. It does hit in an AoE, so there is that. Well, let me start the charge here. There we go. Not bad. Obviously, not quite as good as the previous. Uh, the previous goes there, right? I'll well, just go down here. And now is the point in time that I feel that I am confident enough in the dome that I do not need to be putting everything in there, so that it is so that I have any chance at all of being able to survive more than two waves, right? Because that's that was sort of the going concern there, at least at the last time. And then besides, having an AoE is not quite the same thing as being able to grab you right now. Having an AoE is not quite the same thing as being able to uh, deal with large groups of enemies, as we've seen with the little tiny exploding dudes. Because otherwise, they would be absolutely trivial. They are not. Where something like the Z the really, uh, where something like the sword dome would have made very short work of them, comparatively. At least I'd like to think so. It was going. Eh, actually, I got no time. I was able to k kill a lot of enemies with the sword dome previously. It was a very effective type of... Yeah, you know, I really don't have anything here, so we gotta go right for... I guess you... Speaking of... We're now cut... Ah, right. Yeah, you gotta really have to... Well, that's about as good as I can do. At least the autocannon took out the other enemy then there, too. I still have Cobalt, and I am going to be using that Cobalt for its Cobalt intended purposes when the time comes. Until then, though, it's like the little tiny explodey dudes are, are something that I really got to watch out for. You know, go half and half type of thing. Hit the first half of them, hit the second half of them. Because otherwise it seems like, okay, what do you got here? You have interested me with the existence of some sort of other wacky trinket or whatever. And I'm not even going to bother trying to go in farther here. Because this is maybe the hardest first layer that I have seen in this game. <laughs> it's just all brickwork. Digging in right into a temple. Digging right into the, the temple from, from Environmental Station Alpha here. This is actually exactly how... Uh, uh, well, I'd take either of these, really. Eh, you know, I'll give me the prospecting meter. I, I genuinely do like that. I think that is a pretty... Let's see if it decides to start pinging anywhere around here. No. No, wait, no, no, no. It did actually ping a little bit there for one second. Okay. But yeah, Prospect is pretty good. Yeah, this is the, the prequel to Environmental Station Alpha. Before, you know, everything went wrong. Or right, depending on how you look at it. I'm going to leave two of those things alive. That's fine. Because otherwise I feel like I'm going to be doing worse if I do not deal with this. Yeah, okay, well, good enough. 
Here, you know, actually, uh, if I could remember the buttons here correctly. Let's go with that. I need to start upgrading the, upgrading the mining thing. Now, I did see something over here. It was like... Like, really quickly pinged for me around here. Yeah, here we go. Doesn't have, like, a super huge range, but I do know that means there's something here. I also noticed that directly to my right, that would have been softer dirt. Hey, here we go. <laughs> really not ideal sort of uh, mining practices to begin with, but it's fine. Five should be enough with, uh, with the stuff here. So what do I want to get? I should probably just get speed. Speed to begin with, and then we'll go kinda from there then instead. Obviously still have a lot of other else of interest over here. I mean there could be water or whatever, but I suppose I'm not really gonna be able to have that. Alright. Now then You know, there yeah. yeah. Alright. I do feel like we have the potential for things to start going much better. Things going intangible is not really helping me out too much either, though. Yeah, the cannon to be able to back me up here. Definitely feels like it's doing a good job. It's not ideal. I would prefer if, you know, it was... Ah, come on. I would prefer if it was hitting things a little bit better, but, you know. Good enough, I suppose. Good enough. I'd like to go get that, uh, the range thing on my detector more than anything else. Not super worried about trying to get other resources right now. Being able to find iron, I think, is going to be the most important thing to begin with. Speaking of which, there is really just nothing around here, is there? Oh, no, I'm getting closer. Is it here or is it down more? Yeah, it's down more. Okay. Yep, yeah, there it is. Okay, good. See, already paying off. Right? Of course, again, it's all in just only the hardest uh, brickwork possible, right? But, at least I got it. Grab all of it. I'm gonna go slightly slower, but not too much slower. Actually, real quick. Uh, no. I'm gonna want to grab all of that. Because I can't just... I, all, all I want to do is just say specifically drop water. But it's not going to do that, is it now? Eh. Okay. Hey, can I get another upgrade real quick? Just, uh, you know, maybe a little bit of here or there. Radical speed, not too bad. Quick shot. Quick shot, probably going to be good. Electro orb, I think, with the little tiny guys is going to be more important. Okay, so, for example... Like, actually, exactly what I'm looking for. Now, with that on there, too. And the automated cannon going over there as well. Oh man, you're really not making this one easy, are you? I don't think I can shoot that down. I'm really not quite sure. Well, that's not good. And, of course, I have no upgrades for pretty much anything else. That was all the upgrades that I could get. Well, at least it, uh... Hey, Iron Meter, anything? Just saying. If you... Okay, there's a little bit of something around here. Am I getting closer? No, I'm getting farther away. Tell me it's over here. It looks like it is. Yes, okay. There we go. At least it's something, right? It's not much, but it is something. Oh, man, I tell you. This one is not the most ideal scenario. But at least with five of these, maybe I'll be able to do something. Because I'm only going to be able to get five before <laughs> this, uh, before, you know, anything else here. Can I know I can overcharge the shield. Maybe that's what I wanted to at this point in time. <laughs> You know, because I only, I only got four, right? Or I could just, like, improve the autocannon. You know, improve that autocannon. 
And that means that I at least have a little bit more, uh, a little bit more defensive capabilities. All right, what do I got? Real quick. Deal with you. Real quick. Deal with you. Real quick. Same thing. Pretty much zapping them all until we're done. At least this is a fairly effective type of dome for this wave in particular. Everything else, though, it's still not looking great. Improved auto cannon, I think, also did pretty good there. Yeah, I didn't realize those tentacle things were going to be so uh, difficult there. <laughs> if I know that, would have probably prioritized them rather than the other guys. It's just those other things had been so frustrating to deal with previously that I uh, was a bit worried more about that than anything else. So I also have like the the double shot thing. With the Electro Orb, I don't know if that's as important. Uh, maybe? Only got six. Uh, yeah, we got a quick shot. We got move faster. We got auto aim. Strengthen by shooting it again. Or persistent orbs to stay longer. Uh, uh, yeah, I don't know. More charge, so it is, yeah. I'm just gonna take that, actually. Prolong any things, but I don't have the ability to get that. Overcharge strength. Yeah, just keep going with the overcharge strength, because I got water. I have at least one water to give me. If I don't have cobalt, I do at least have water to give me a little bit of extra health there, right? That's at least the way that I'm looking at this right now. And I'm not seeing any more iron over here. I'm seeing a lot more brickwork. I'm very happy to see that. Well, <laughs> time to go back up to the surface already. Good, good, good. Really exactly what I wanted. See, I'm not going nearly as well as the previous dome, now is it? Sword dome was really doing some good work there. Uh... And there goes that. Oh, yeah, no, it's not looking too hot now at all, is it? And I started charging up too quickly. And it's on. <laughs> well, I mean, it, I felt like I didn't really want to... You know, I'm going to keep the auto cannon again. Well, let's see in the mine here. Why not? Uh... I felt like I didn't really want to wait for the tentacle to pop back out of the ground again because I was getting attacked by a bunch of other things, too. Mm hmm So were there any deposits at all in this entire... uh, mine? <laughs> Can I go any farther? Uh, well... Nah, uh, yeah. Prospecting meter as much as I like that. I don't think it's going to be too useful. Okay, I'm going to give it one more try here, but uh, I don't know about this dome right now. It seems like it's got way too many weaknesses. <laughs> and I was even prioritizing trying to, to level it up at the very beginning there. Still really couldn't do too much for uh, trying to defend anything. Well, one more time, one more time. Maybe this will be the one, right? Yeah, I tried to go for a very pinpoint type of thing with uh, with a, a dome. He is not really working, is I think the problem right now. Hey, hey, now we can just see stuff immediately. Yeah, hitting specific monsters. I mean, maybe if I had the mouse control. I'm just saying, I would really like that mouse control. That'd be pretty great. But as it's going right now, it's not that good. Or at least it wasn't good enough for uh, the very beginning here, if nothing else. I don't even know if I would say that's the very beginning. Uh, come on now. What do you mean? I don't even know if I would say that's the very beginning exactly. 
And then I suppose I should start out with the Electro Orb thing again. Because that one was doing good work, if nothing else. You also, of course, do have the second uh, dude down there to help out. This is a fairly cheap one. It is a fairly cheap one, too. Well, okay. You know, I did get through the first couple things easy enough. So let's take that immediately. And then see how this goes for the first one. Oh, Cobalt. Nice. I'd like to go grab that, but I also know that I really want to do this immediately here. All right. It is relatively cheap. Okay. Uh, it is relatively cheap to get the, the Electro Orb then, too. It's only four iron. I feel like I at least got that going right now rarer stuff. That means I can start to overclock the shield and everything immediately, too. Yeah, there's stuff going on here. Maybe. We have to, we'll see. <laughs> now that I got the the meter pretty much immediately, you should make stuff easier for that, too. Just taking one more second. The difficulty that I was having in the first layer before, I feel like going down immediately is not the worst idea. You know what? I don't think it was the worst idea. Not that water's super important right now, but it might be important later. Eventually, you understand. Go like one more, one, two more blocks or something. Okay. And that's pretty much all I'm going to be able to do. So yeah, and then you got like meters to tell you when you can get back up here. Nah, I got it well enough. Okay, uh, didn't really work out, but, you know. <laughs> and there we go. Not too much damage. Shield was able to take care of most of that, so I am fine with that sort of thing. Here, let's just get back down to this sort of area instead. Oh boy, oh boy. I feel like I'm already doing better on resources and everything. Four is about the max I can do, but if I just take three right now, that should be fine. Right, right. No problems at all. Anyway. Okay, so I do only have three. Uh, do I want to just, like, go and immediately get speed? Do I want to go and try and get the, the Super Dome upgrade? Super Dome upgrade is maybe putting it a little bit excessively. But the one that does the Electroshock Orb... Well, th th that's just what I call it. That's the colloquial name for it, uh, the Super Dome Upgrade. Not even a dome, it's just a big ol'... You know, you should have seen this coming when the fact that it wasn't a dome, right? Okay, I'll do that. If this was a dome, it would be doing so much better. Truly, this is where we all went wrong. When we decided that it's just like, does it really need to be a dome shape? Maybe it can be like a big triangle. Triangles are very tough domes, right? As we all know, in nature, that is one of the more powerful types of... One of the more powerful types of uh, shapes that exist. But then again, isn't like the most powerful type of shape? Uh, a big old... Uh, a big old, like, um, egg or something like that. That's why, that's why eggs are eggs. <laughs> something like that. I don't know. I'm not a mathematician or a scientist. The doctorate I have is in video games, of course. As we've established, as we all know, I'm sick of explaining this to everybody. Okay, whatever. I can probably try and, like, drag stuff along the ground there. I do know that's the strat used by super pro players, but at the same time, eh, it is fine. I'm gonna click, I want to grab you first, then probably bigger package? This has been a lot more friendly ground to drill through compared to the previous run. So, there is that. Uh, you know what? I'm just gonna keep going. We will, we will rock you. Okay, well, it doesn't really work as well when you're going against this ground, right? Okay. There we go. Come on, baby. Pretty good time. And also, can I... Eh, three. That's not quite enough to get anything. Or is it? 
Eh, you know what, sure. <laughs> and you know what? Autonomy. Yeah. I will genuinely take autonomy there. Okay. Actually got it zapped in motion. Good. I was sort of hoping that that's how that would work, but you know. You never really know, right? Oh, okay. Okay. Actual progress being made. Will it last? Yes. Absolutely. You know, th th it's like we got to start putting up the signs right now. Craft is never going to be destroyed and everything's going to be great forever. Trust me. If, you, if there are any sort of apocalyptic scenarios, you want to start doing that sort of thing immediately. And the world is super great and awesome and we all love it. And nothing ever goes wrong in here. I was saying before that I was playing Death Stranding recently, and you, you know what they do there? It's like you get like signs for free parking. Not as much like big dumb uh, billboards or something that says, hey, America's super great and awesome and wonderful and we love it. And nothing ever bad happens in America. Grab that immediately. I, should, I don't really have the time to do much of anything else. Just saying they really missed out. Overall, they do go for the, the more natural type of... Okay, they do go for the more natural type of... Uh, 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 the scenery and everything in that game, as opposed to giving me like a bunch of billboards or abandoned buildings or something. Which, to be honest, I would like to see a little bit more of that. I always like seeing the weird window dressing. You know, we're talking like a low-poly food and video games and everything, but... I want to go for the natural beauty of America, which, uh, sure, that's fine. Or the natural beauty of a bunch of rocks everywhere. <laughs> you got to do your Amazon package deliveries through. Still enjoying that game a lot. You never played Death Stranding before. I guess this game is going to be, I guess this episode is going to be called Dome Stranding. Nah, 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 this is 40 minutes into it. People aren't even going to know about it. When I started doing the uh, Doctor Inferno Firebird reviews, other games that he's been playing recently. Uh, okay, but yeah, it is, um, it's a good game. I like it. I'm kind of surprised it's so divisive because I do genuinely think that it just takes the open world formula of having large distances to walk all the time everywhere and tries to actually do something interesting with it. Now, don't get me wrong. The plot is absurd. <laughs> it's super dumb. The weird mythologizing of deliveries, but also the way that everything is just absolutely caked in, in an inescapable layer of ridiculous, silly lore is honestly a, a lot of fun because, you know, you never know where the plot is about to be going next is the thing. And that's what makes it fun. There's this sort of idea that it's always going to be something wacky by the time. Any cutscene you see is going to be engaging just because it's so ridiculously wacky. <laughs> and it is stupid. It is absolutely ridiculous. It's a very simple type of story. But like I said, it has so much lore just caked onto it with everything. Nothing... Nothing is simple in this universe. You think that you're just going to get a straightforward, simple explanation. Uh, like, hey, you don't want to kill people because killing people is, you know, not really something a delivery driver should be doing in the first place. But also, you know, you're killing people. What does this do? Sends a pulse reveal nearby resources. Must be charged. Give me the lift. I like that. I like, I like, a, I like a little lift. Well, yeah, it's like, oh, you don't, well, you don't want to kill people because killing people is bad. And it's like, yeah, yeah you know, fair enough. I, I agree with that. <laughs> I, I do, I, 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 I'm the sort of person that can get down with the idea of don't kill people. It's like, no, 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 you don't want to kill people because then their spirit will try to return to their body. And the dead interacting with the world of living, of course, uh, causes an antimatter explosion, which explodes so huge that it will literally destroy any nearby cities. It's like, I... Okay. <laughs> like, that's... That's that's good. 
You know, like, no, 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 you're not carrying around a baby because, you know, the, 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 the most precious, precious cargo of all is a baby, isn't it now? Ah, I actually do need to do that this time. It's like, no, 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 you're carrying around a baby because it lets you see ghosts. Because <laughs> the world has, has changed since death got stranded there. And now you need babies that can see ghosts. <laughs> it's it's great. It's great. It's it's like they, there's a bunch of weird, ridiculous things happening at all points in time, even in between the idea that they try to make a gameplay out of walking to a location. Logistics is the gameplay. And I like that more interesting than just walking down a big old field and you occasionally fight like a, a group of goblins or something. I, I enjoy a good goblin fight and everything, but a lot of stuff with open world is just walking to a location. Something like this game, for example, does also have that type of thing. But the reason why it works is because, you know, you're, you're balancing greed and greed and resource collection and everything like that there's tight time limits and everything on this you don't really get that with a lot of other open world games and i don't think you really want to get that with a lot of other open world games just because that means then that do you really want to have to sit around here be worried about yeah you really don't want to sit around here you know and be worried about stuff like oh man am i gonna be able to get to the town to fight the goblins fast enough or is everybody gonna die over in towningville because i didn't pass through no no you want to have the time to be able to to breathe to look around to see all of the the sights that there are to be seen or discover stuff and being able to also make that a part of the game Something like, uh, what was it, old Zelda Wind Waker, what with the boat mechanics. But the boat mechanics were all very simple, is the thing. Which is why I, I, I never was particularly impressed by that game. You're trying to keep your footing and everything like that is a big part of the game. And it, it's, it's fun like that. Even if the plot is super, super, super dumb. I cannot overstate that enough. <laughs> the plot of Death Stranding is really stupid. Oh, wow, three. <laughs> I'll take it. I was sort of like, I'm only going to get one from this. I'm hoping to get more, but eh, we'll see, right? I can't remember exactly how the lift works. It's like it needs to... The little orbs around here are the things that actually haul stuff up. But at the same time, you do also get just like a boost to being in it, right? Something like that. Ah, whatever. It doesn't matter. Let me take a look. See if there's anything else I can get. It doesn't really look like it. Gotta get those lifting orbs. Orb speed. Oh yeah, no, that's something you need to unlock. But it is something I do want. Because right now, at least. Okay, well. Actually, that might be a strategy. Just to keep a. Ah, just keep like. Okay, we need to focus on this. These guys got big, beefy buff arms. Ah. Couldn't get him in time. Honestly, I was sort of hoping that the auto cannon combined with the stunning there was going to do a little bit more, but yeah, not quite. Six is a little bit too much for me. Yeah, I knew auto cannon would take care of that. Okay, so I got faster movement in here now. Feeling good with that. I'm pretty good. Honestly, that's the whole thing. It, if your plot's going to be dumb, at least make it weird enough. <laughs> and I think that's an important thing. Just make it really weird. I think a lot of other games can learn from that. Because I'm going to be paying attention to the plot regardless, as I'm sure you probably have seen in many a game I have played before. Hey, haul an orb. Take these things. Yeah, okay. I thought I remembered how that worked well enough. Oh, yeah, right, right, right. Don't forget. I, I totally forgot that I was working on these things down here, right? <laughs> Get everything into the shaft to work. I mean, I do always very much enjoy a just, like, super ridiculously 
unnecessarily um, just like idiotic plot. <laughs> that I think the, there's something to be said about even if it doesn't matter, going all out with it. And maybe something like Death Stranding goes a little bit too far. There are some quite lengthy cutscenes. <laughs> you never played that game before. They are long. They are long. <laughs> they are strong cutscenes. But at the same time, at least they're engaging in their own way. Because like I said, nothing can be like normal. It always has to be something weird and stupid about it. Yeah, you really didn't number on the dome last time. Honestly, I'm just gonna let the auto cannon take care of the rest of it. Yep, I knew it. <laughs> I knew that'd work. Feeling like I'm judging some of how the basics of keeping this dome here is going a little bit better now. Good, after two losses there, I'm only, I'm only hoping. After all, I would like to be able to just, you know, start of the next episode, use the next dome rather than having to, I, you know, likely could go to a stream. Eh, not perfect, but well, it's not even really gonna impede me to haul this around at all. Was that a second deposit? Oh, okay. No. I was thinking that was more cobalt, which was gonna no surprise me there. Don't get me wrong, I'll take okay, okay, we're getting some stuff here. A little bit of stuff, a little bit of speed. Okay, we're gonna have to drop a little bit of that, but we can try, uh, get everything else over into the shaft just through the power of dragging. All right, and then the orbs will take care of the rest. I'm gonna drop one more. Uh, yeah, that should be good. All right, this should probably be enough to get me another upgrade and everything too. Thinking about it right now. Yeah, yeah, maybe, 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 maybe. Additional lift and orb. Ah, eh. I'll carry resources. Nah, I don't have enough for that. Oh, let's take a look here. Uh, okay. Auto aim, quick shot, even faster reticle. Although I could just go for... No, 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 I can't go for that. I don't have enough. Um, okay. Give me speed right now. You know what? I, I feel like that's probably a worthwhile type of thing. Auto cannon also doing a good job over here, too. Get it right on the edge there so that I can get as much, um... Stuff as possible. Oh, get the stun in there. There we go. Nice. Okay. Yeah, it's interesting. This is. Uh, I, I was sort of thinking that this was going to be the the one. Oh, no, no, no. The orbs got. It. Orbs got it. Don't don't worry, everybody. The orbs got it. Well, we were all worried there for a second that the orb might not be able to pull its own weight, much less the weight of the resources that I'm putting into it. But it's got it. Don't worry. Getting a good amount of iron on this one. Good. Good, good, good. Wanna still try and get the other the other thing unlocked here, of course. Ah! Or be, d d take a couple of these things. Yeah, that, that should be enough. And this should be good for me to begin with, especially knowing that I have the... Get in there. Okay. Especially knowing that I have the uh, the extra speed and everything here, too. It's pretty handy. Okay. What do I want? Oh, more carry. I don't know if carry strength is quite what I need here. Well, one of the things I can do is nurture the orbs. More persistent orbs. Ah. We'll stay for longer. It's really not a bad idea, right? You know what? I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it with the expectation that I am going to be shooting. Because I've already been doing that, right? Anything else I can just get real quick. Yep. That was worth it. Okay. And anything, anything, anything else that I can get real quick. Uh, no, if I had more water, maybe. More charge shield. We do also got the machine gun and everything, which is pretty good, but I don't have any more water. Wow, tar. Okay, just get out here. 
fact, let's just still start. Oh, good. Yeah, I guess I did an upgrade that, didn't I? So send that in there. You. One more. Yeah. Releasing it too quickly. That wasn't enough, hey? Okay, well, it's fine. It's fine, it's fine, it's fine. I was getting a, a little bit worrying there. Okay, now one of the things is there was another, uh, there was another, like, trinket or whatever down here that I could get, right? That I saw at some point. They should really go get that. Yeah, definitely. Oh, no, it's another one of the water ones. Well, if I find more water, I will obviously put it in. That's just really good. But at the same time, though, too, do kind of got to hurry up with for other things. I would also, like, enjoy to have some water. Enjoy to have. Yeah. That's a word I want to say. Come on. Anything else. Anything else. We're going down the shaft here. Uh, you know, this game doesn't really have any lore now, does it? Just thinking about that right now. The lore is dome. <laughs> and then aside from that, what more do you need, really? But, I mean, that's not that important. Come on. The important thing with, like, having the lore is to just be... It's, 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 uh... Nice to have something to be able to get interested in if it... If at any point in time you start to get kind of like, Eh, you know what, the game is doing, eh, whatever. Then suddenly you're like, oh, wait a second. Little do you know the amount of ridiculous nonsense that this game has to offer if you just begin looking into it. Like, you would think this is about spooky robots or whatever that yell at people really loud. Well, it is. Well, you know. It's that whole thing that, oh, wow. Well, here's where this is really going to shine, right? Nur nurture orb is exactly what I was hoping for with this type of thing, yeah? Check that out. Keep that sort of progress right there. That was pretty good. Ah, uh, But yeah, there's so much more going on too, right? Hey, nice. Just keep getting all of these things, I suppose. Can never have enough, right? Hey, you, can you haul this? No, it looks like... Okay, I guess that's probably uh, hoping a little bit too much for the orbs here. They do resources. They don't do ancient artifacts uh, buried on the ground, of course. What do we got? Condenser, eh. Teleporter, eh. Well, you know what? I'll actually take the condenser. Because I do want that. Because, like, a little bit of water here, not a bad idea, i got to say. Uh, overcharge stuff, production speed, of course. Um, hmm. Stores water. But, I mean, you know, having two, as I do. And I don't have enough iron for this. But we'll do that later. <laughs> Fine, then. I do actually want some water. So, that is like... I, I should also go over here. It's weird that I haven't even tried to explore this shaft a little bit more. And now it makes sense as to why I didn't really explore this shaft anymore. It's a large area that, you know, you'd think would have some. But it didn't. Okay, well, at least it's... Eh, here we go. Here we are. Okay, I really have way too much, though, here. We gotta start getting over there right now. But getting an upgrade for the... I got autonomy and everything on... Okay, uh, got autonomy and everything on the... Get, ah, whatever. We'll get grabbed by the orbs. Go right now. Okay, real quick. Is there anything else I can get? Uh, no, no. Well, I do have six now. Um, you know what? That's heretical. No, I, d do the battle thing. You know what? Will you? 
And then hoping for a little bit of stun timing on all this sort of stuff. Oh boy, this was not a good... Oh man, oh man. And I do not have any... Oh boy. Oh, that was... It was pretty bad. Not that I think that it would be much better if I uh, got there earlier, but certainly it wouldn't have hurt. All right. Where was the uh, stuff that I was getting? Sort of hoping I was able to be able to do that faster, to be honest. But eh, it didn't work out that way. Now I'm just hoping that I get any amount of cobalt. Well, at least I do have the shield here and everything, too. Right? Okay. want to just like start drilling into this right now just so that it has just so that it can start to also get into the uh, the shaft here too to be brought back up I'm also hauling this one up here eh, a little bit not as much as I quite wanted but that's okay but it was not okay it's mostly okay <laughs> it's really looking bad, isn't it? Oh well. You know what? Actually, yes. Oh hey, look! I just got a little bit of extra health! How about that, everybody? Can't hardly believe it myself. Any way that I can possibly go get any more of this? I don't think so. I try. No. Okay, well, yeah, there's the iron right there, but I'm not gonna go for that one. Not after, uh... What's been going on here? Hey! Let's just go start getting some electro orbs around here. Immediately. Yeah. Good. Yeah, actually kind of anticipating stuff here does seem to be way more effective, isn't it? <laughs> Alright, fair enough. Fair enough. Definitely seems to be the way that you want to go with, uh, with, with this particular dome, right? You get, like, two for that, uh, that thing to carry over there. If I get another 14, I can go and get another, uh, health upgrade and make this work even better. <laughs> Doing the big plays here, baby! The big, highly questionable plays. Also, give me that. There we go. Thank you, Condenser. You have really saved me here. Might even be worth it for this, though, too. Uh, well, you know, I'll just make sure that I get here early, right? Early bird gets the, the early the zappy turret. And that's really all we... Hey, baby, that's what I'm looking for. Getting that cobalt, all the triangles that I could want. And this is a triangle dome, not a dome if you think about it. But I don't think too much at all, as you can probably tell. Uh, hmm. yes. If I thought more, maybe I would do better at this game, but I refuse. And I just uh, rely entirely on getting lucky, but you can't argue because it's working. Just like a real quick dig through here since I got the the drill to be able to do it right. Okay, we gotta go. Thankfully, uh, the, the shaft makes this pretty easy to get back up here, right? Because like I said, it, it does seem like an important part of... Anything else I can get? Eh, I got it. It does seem like an important part of this entire thing is, for example, doing that. Um, hoping you can do something here. Auto turret. I know you're trying the best. Okay. Ugh. Not ideal, but worked. Right. <laughs> Okay, okay. Here, we got anything else over here real quick. At this point in time, I probably should just be starting to look for the relic and all that. But at the same time... Uh, oh, look at this. Well, it paid off now, didn't it? I 
I'll just go drag these into the shaft. Yep. You too. And yeah, this should be another couple upgrades right here. Just like that, baby. It's as easy as that. Get out. Get over here. I think getting caught on the side is the problem right now. <laughs> That's not really a problem. It's hardly a problem. Could be a problem, though. If you want to be. Okay. What is the plan now? Persistent orbs? Eh, probably. Mm -hmm. Perfect timing. Do you want more powerful? Ugh, that seems really hard to do. Increase damage even more. Quick shot. Ah, do I want to do a quick shot? I mean, it's probably not like the worst idea. We want to go down here and look at some other stuff now that I have. Yeah, here we go. Yeah, baby, let's do it. Don't have enough for that, but maybe soon. Actually, don't know. I don't know how, really how long the condenser has to start condensing. It's already really paid for itself. Feel like. So, I'm not going to argue with that. Anything else just real quick like here? Nope. Okay, I need to get back now. See, I don't need to pay for the ability to get back here, uh, to tell me when to get back here. I know when I need to do it. And besides, getting back here a little bit early just gives me the ability to start shooting out um, early uh, orbs, right? Quickly. How are you not dead yet? Yeesh. Yeah, he's taking a beating. Keeping on yeeting. Okay. Anything else? Uh, no, I think we're just like looking at um, getting down pretty far and seeing like what's down here now. It's relatively soft dirt, which is sort of what I was hoping for. And this thing. I don't know what this is. And, okay, we got the actual thing. Good. And water. Good, good. See? Making progress. Might be able to successfully keep a dome yet. I'm telling you. I don't really try and... I don't know if I should start going back just yet. Okay. Now I got a good idea of where everything's at. Yeah, it's looking good. It's looking good. Looking saucy right now. And of course, having extra uh, cobalt here too. Not a bad thing at all. Now, I don't know what this thing that I just got is or what it does, but I suppose we're about to find out. Also, give me this. Well, I don't know. I think it just exploded. <laughs> I'm fairly certain, judging by that sound effect, it just exploded. All right. Good. Now, what, are we, what, are we, what else are we looking for here? Yeah, you know what? You know what? Sounds good to me. Uh, well, wherever it exploded, I got no idea. I guess I'm not going to... Oh, wait a second. I did, 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 we're like right at the... I wasn't even looking at the monster meter there. Okay, uh, no, there's nothing else I'm gonna be able to get. I'll start out with you. We'll go and get you. We'll go and get you one more time. Oh, wow, this is. Hey, machine gun, do, uh, machine gun is doing a good job over here. Oh, you don't! You think you're gonna get over here? You're not gonna get over here. I'm hitting you so hard. We're also in the air. Uh, yeesh. Thought it was going to get over here. It did not get it. It, 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 it got kind of close. I'm not going to lie there. I was a little bit worried. Yeah, I know I should probably be going for the thing, but I was... Yeah, yeah, yeah that's sort of pointing in this general direction, which is what I was looking for. Okay. And the next one... 
Should be able to find the second one pretty easy too then as well. Okay, that's very easy as it turns out. And third one over here is gonna be pretty close to the actual wall, so it can't be too far. Indeed it is not. Okay, well, I'm just, let's just end the game then. <laughs> I'll take a win. Sure. That went pretty easy. Boggers. All right. Shaft should also make it nice and easy to just haul this thing right back up. See? Simple. All you got to do is just get really lucky with everything that happens and still nearly die anyway. <laughs> it's not even hard. Hey, right, do I have anything else that I can really get? No, not really. I knew I'd be able to get you up here. Come on. Yeah, I'm trying my best here, but it's just like, you know, I don't think this one's gonna do it. Now we're gonna be able to beat this without using stupid artifact. Well, whatever. Hooray! Right. And skull artifact in hand, I got another win going. It only took two tries. Unlocking a well, mint. It's the artillery dome. There it is. Potent mortar. Anti-air gun. All right. Well, that's obviously going to be next time. And I do think that, uh, oh boy, the final dome. Because as far as I can tell, this is kind of like the major. Oh, okay. Potent anti-air. Okay, so that's how that does. Well, Check that one out next time then, right?